New for you this morning, the theater world is mourning the loss of a veteran performer. Tony winner Ray Allen has died at 95 years old. Now, the Brooklyn-born star appeared in the original Broadway production of Damn Yankees. She also made several memorable appearances in TV and film. PIX 11's Vanessa Freeman joins us now in the studio with a look back at her storied career. Good morning, Vanessa. Good morning, Hazel. Good morning, Dania. Just an amazing woman. Ray Allen was a New Yorker through and through. She was born in Brooklyn in 1926 and studied drama at the world-renowned HB Studio in Greenwich Village. Years later, she would get her big break. Who came along in a puff of smoke? Shoot the stove from Hannibal Mo. Strong as the heart of the mighty O. Shoot the stove from Hannibal Mo. Allen was cast in the original Broadway production of Damn Yankees. Her performance as nosy reporter Gloria Thorpe earned her a Tony nomination in 1955. Three years later, she was cast in the same role in the musical was turned into a movie. Allen appeared in several more Broadway shows throughout her illustrious career, finally winning a Tony in 1971 for playing uh, in Miss Reardon Drinks a Little. Allen had supporting roles as Aunt Quintina Bladetto in The Sopranos and as Penny Marshall in A League of Their Own. You may more easily recognize Ray on TV. Seeing if, see if this rings a bell here. So where have you been looking for work? Well, you know what I've discovered, Mrs. Sokol? <clears throat> it's not so much the looking <laughs> as the listening. <laughs> I listen for work. And as I'm looking and listening, I'm also looking. You cannot discount looking. It's sort of a combination. It's looking and listening, listening and looking. But you must look. Can you be specific? <laughs> That's right. She had a run. A run in there with George Costanza. Alan appeared on Seinfeld as Mrs. Sokol, an unemployment office worker whose daughter is dating George. So, guys, Ray Allen clearly loved to perform. She continued to appear on TV until 2011 when she was 84 years old. Deadline reports she passed away in her sleep of natural causes. Allen was 95 years old.